Hello everyone, myself Dr. Amit Dhakoji. I am the consultant and head of the department neurosurgery at Manipal Hospitals, Baner, Pune. So today we are going to discuss about stroke and being a neurosurgeon, I encounter many hemorrhagic strokes. So whenever there is an acute vascular insult to the brain, we call it as a stroke and the strokes can be of ischemic variety or hemorrhagic variety. So ischemic variety strokes that is because of thrombosis or clot in the blood vessel of the brain usually is a domain of neurologist while hemorrhagic strokes which are because of bleeding inside the brain or skull department that is hemorrhagic stroke comes as a comes as an emergency for a neurosurgical department so hemorrhagic strokes could be intracranial hemorrhage that is intraparenchymal hemorrhage or it could be a subarachnoid hemorrhage which is a csf containing space inside the brain or it could be intraventricular hemorrhage. Ventricles are the water carrying uh, pipes of the brain. So these hemorrhagic strokes manifest as sudden onset severe headache, never experienced headache in the life of the patient or they can also manifest sometimes as seizures or epilepsy and the usual investigation is a CT scan of the brain and if CT scan shows a particular pattern of bleed then we admit these patients and investigate further for the cause of intracranial bleed. So hemorrhagic strokes are very important and uh, very crucial neurosurgical emergencies and they have to be managed by a comprehensive team like emergency medicine, neurosurgeon, neurologist and intensive care specialist. At Manipal Hospital Baner, we have a state of the art emergency department and a neurosurgical unit as well as a neurological unit and we manage these strokes very efficiently we also have interventional neuroradiologist and we can also do digital subtraction angiographies of the brain for further evaluation of these strokes thank you